Was it hard at the beginning? Yeah. It was hard. It was very, very hard, you know? But you stick it out. That's what I did. And look at me now. No one gets here on their own. We know that. You have to have someone. Someone else in your life who can help you get where you're going. And for me, that man was David Stott. He didn't work in my office, but he was always there. We sold athletic equipment, small firm. And he was a coach for um, something, I can't. David, what sport was that? He can't hear me. This is years ago, mind you. You should have seen me then. I looked so different. You can't even imagine. But he was in my office and we just clicked. I wasn't very popular then. I didn't have a lot of friends. I, I spent most of my time writing, as you'd imagine. So much writing. This is before, of course, but I used to sit by myself in this big room we had and just write and write. Please! Did the tether balls come in? No. God damn it. Mr. Henry wasn't very nice to me. No one really was. Except David. He never said anything to me, really. But it was the way he didn't say anything, you know? We did have one exchange. Oh, oh, my, god. Oh, oh, oh my god, I oh. I am so sorry, Mr. That's, Stott. That's fine. Is it broken? Oh. No, but it's very badly hurt. Oh, oh well. <laughs> Why did you do that? Oh, it's, it's just something that I do sometimes. I should probably go. It's nice in here, isn't it? It's our, our showroom. Usually, right, right now it's nothing. I like to come in here and just think and, and write. That's what I do. I am a writer. I write. Sometimes. I just... You really do just do that? Yep. Well, it's very cute. That was it. That was all the encouragement I needed. I knew I had to ask him out then and there. It was now or never. You've got to seize the day. Grab the bull by the horns and just hold on for David. Oh, hi. 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 Um, I was wondering if you wanted to go out with me sometime. Go out? Yep. With you? Yep. Louise? Yep. I I'm gay. What? I'm, I'm gay. I'm gay. Have you ever seen me? I mean, there's not a straight bone in my body. I, I mince. When I laugh, I go like this. Look, you're, you're very sweet. Um, and, uh, quirky, let's say. But I'm just, you know, too... <laughs> gay. It was a blow, certainly. But what do you do in that circumstance? You pick yourself up, you dust yourself off, you get yourself back to fighting weight, you move on. So, David Stott wasn't the love of my life, so what? The work is what's important, and always has been. Don't you agree?
Luiz. I said I was sorry like a billion times.